hello friends welcome to fm electricals in this video i will show you how to operate bms through computer so th this is very important video who wants to learn about the bms operation so uh, i am near the computer i am going to operate through the computer these are you can see there is air handling units fan coil units vab units ventilation fans this all we can switch off uh, turn on turn off through this computer so this is we can say as a remote controller remote operation we can say it so this is the bms so this is the animation uh, if you want to learn about the scada and plc in the next video i will uh, explain so here you can see the, this the fan is rotating and uh, here it's working on this demand open means this bab is open 100 percent now here you can see system parameters means uh, what is the status means hu auto status it's uh, working on auto and uh, here you can see hu run status means it is in running condition and hu trip status means if it it, it will get trip it will show normal now this is the thing uh, temperature degree celsius is showing return air temperature is showing 18 degree and uh, what is the status for hu on office there then uh, in this uh, BMS, this all are in interface with this system. So here you can see. Now I will go to the back. So I will show you. Here you can see there are uh, how many six HU are there, and uh, so this the HU two. So the same thing. Here you can see this is also in auto mode, and in in it is in running position, and. Uh, now you can see all these uh, parameters a valve open is 88.5 percent and here you uh, i will show you this is for unit number two now we will go to hu3 in hu in hu3 you can see it's also running but the temperature temperature is different here actual supply air temperature is 13.2 and here you can see this also is in running and uh, the temperature e return air temperature 19 and the return air temperature sp in the supply side is 22 degrees celsius and here you can see occ schedule this all are there so now we will go to the next hu now we will go to the fcu these are the fcu uh, already interface with the bms these are the vab then th these are the ventilation fan pressurization file also we can say so one by one i will open all this and then i will show you so you will be very uh, much uh, you will understand so here you can you see this is for exhaust fan so here we have four options fan on off status trip status and auto status and uh, this fan is not uh, running so i will just resetting now it's uh, showing normal but the run status is stopped sometimes it take time to switch on so let's wait the other one is working now we will check another uh, exhaust fan here uh, all are running so here there is no any problem then we will check 10 to 13 here exhaust fan 10a 10b is off so we will try to on now you can see these are the floors uh, actually now now i have logged out so here you can see each system it's showing so now we went to plumbing this is for generator here this is for central battery system means through this we can switch on or we can switch off also so here some faults are showing so we need to uh, interface and we need to check this is for pump this means uh, what is the tank 
uh, fill percentage here you can see means it is a little bit near to the lower now this is for pump pump is now in a stop position uh, now for the elevator uh, still it is not interface but in the software is already designed so here you can see the same thing now we are checking that uh, all fcu and all hu is running or not so now it's all are not running just we are verifying that all fcus are running or not so here also it's in running position now hu6 will check here also it's in running position exhaust fan also all are running but uh, some exhaust fan are not running two exhaust fans are stopped so i i will just try to on and reset it so let's see let's just i will just actually it's not a starting there is some problem with the existing system other fans are running yeah this all are running so uh, actually i wanted to show this one because uh, uh, through this you will have idea how to do operation for a bma system through the computer so for different version of software you will have the different interface display so but from this you will have some idea that how to do the remote uh, operation through the computer and through the bms how you can switch on the unit and switch off the unit and how you will get the data so